February 3rd, 2010, was the last time Texas beat Oklahoma in Norman. And today, they look to stop that streak as number six, Texas, takes on number 21, Oklahoma. Looks like she was waiting for the double team. That time, Oklahoma didn't bring it. Williams on the inside. Look at Texas' advantages for today, Brenda. Well, the advantages they have, they've been playing consistent defense. It has helped them to grind through some wins. They haven't lost on the road yet this year. Little one on three, and she's going to wisely hold it up. Ortiz for three, and she rolls it over the front of the rim. Before, the, before they played Iowa State, and she did not like this team's energy level. But since winning at Iowa State and then winning at home against Oklahoma State, she's been pleased with the way they're playing. She had that step, and in the past, you could have put an arm bar on her and shoved her out of the way. Well, that's a foul now, and you, you're rewarding the offensive player that gets a step. Nice job defensively, Rodrigo getting the hands up. Up ahead to McCarty, Boyette, nice pass for the layup. How about that hustle by Imani Boyette, you know, just to get that shot in transition, that layup, and to get those free throws, that can make a world of difference for a player to get them back on track. Here Louise trying to keep it perfect, and she does. It's two 0 for 7 shooting the ball, no points. Her first field goal today. And then Edwards with the steal. Got McCarty to beat the big step to scoop. This has played well, which affects their offense. Williams only four minutes in that opening half. Up ahead, Atkins. Count the basket and the foul. Themselves a better position right. in the Big 12 tournament. Texas right there in a tie virtually for first place or one game out with Baylor winning yesterday. Oklahoma not being able to. Inside of five minutes left in the quarter. Davenport posting up on Carter. The pull-up knocks it down. D.B. Pierre-Louis up off Oklahoma's bench. Inside to Taylor. Beautiful pass. <laughs> that would have been pretty impressive. Texas with a chance to take the lead. McCarty. Yes. But there was a lot of pain on her face after she slid. Williams. With three to shoot. Tough shot, got it. Oklahoma takes the lead. They haven't scored well today. Lang has to give it up. Shot clock at four. Rodrigo to Atkins. Manning gets another block, her second of the ball game. For Texas, shot over 50% the first time these two teams played in Austin. They're shooting 28%. Carter to the hole, the lead is a dozen. Final 60 seconds. And that is only the fourth point for Texas in this quarter. And that's going to do it. The Oklahoma Sooners win at the final 74-56. For Brenda Van Lang and I'm Ron Thulin. Thanks for watching.